random memorial to Tony Grigsby. But today we are playing. Listen up, newbies over there on the end. Veteran players on set two. This is the wrong answer. This is the right answer. You are playing to win a whole thing of buying a sausages. That's what the winner gets. Right. Because that's what my hometown, New Hope, used to be named before the Yankees burned it down. And then they renamed hey, it New Hope. And you can put that on pizza. And pizza. if they come through again, they may burn it down again. We'll name it something else. Newer Hope. That's right. All right. No electronic devices such as cell phones or iPads, except by me, can be used during the playing of this game. These are current event questions. Do y'all all remember who John Glenn is, the astronaut? Astronaut, yeah. His birthday was today. Is today. How old is he? 92. What did you say, Blake? 95. 95 is the right answer, Blake, Blake, because he's going to Mississippi State. He knows all the answers this morning. So we'll give you that one. Uh, Decatur Daily had an editorial. Only you would know the answer to this question. Uh -oh. This is in the paper this morning. No pressure. Alabama <laughs> has how many bridges? Well, I have no idea how many bridges. 250. 2,500. 2,500. Good answer, but wrong. They have 485 miles of bridges. Oh, that's an easy question, Mark. How many oh, bridges? Yeah, really? And they're all structurally damaged to some degree, as you can uh, yeah, tell. Say. How many bridges would there be in the great state of Alabama? 500. 485 miles. All right, nobody knows. 15,000. 15,986 oh, bridges. Well, that was an easy question. You there, now that. you know. In case somebody asked you that today, <laughs> Dr. Smith, out in your travels. All right, they're putting well, a new, I think I've been through just about most of them. They're putting a new Kroger right down the road from us. It's yeah. called a marketplace store. What does that mean? What does it carry? A marketplace. Mark, mark, uh, farm fresh, fresh produce. Fresh, fresh, fresh produce. produce, yeah. It only a carries a few groceries. Uh, it is their newest thing, 120,000 square feet. It will carry home goods, clothing, and a toy department. What? All really? of that in a Now, y'all have learned something today. Mm, wow. Now we know. The way this works, girls and guys, ask questions, best of your knowledge, you try to. AL.com just did a thing on the best hot dog places in the state of Alabama. Two or three of those are local, none from Limestone County. We went by there. What one is in Huntsville? Well, the oldest diner in Huntsville. Oh, uh, another old governor tried Blue Springs. Big Springs is it. That is a correct answer, Mark. Big Spring Cafe. Big Spring Cafe. I don't know, most people probably eat in there, but yeah, it's got the hot dog there. Downtown Dogs in Decatur. I don't know if it's open right now. That guy yeah. got arrested for murder the yes. other day, killing him. Yeah. Oh, that ain't a good yeah, story. It's not open. Huh? What was they using for the hot dog? He killed a guy uh, in his, over a girl. That's not hot dog it in Madison was on there. Shaggy's Burgers over there. Humphrey's Bar and Grill. So anyway, not any from Athens. All right, here's one I need to ask y'all right now. It's talking about Donald Trump. They're talking about bring a, those hats, bring a, make America great again, right. or safe again, or whatever. And he says he, they describe him as a gimme hat. What is a gimme hat? A hat someone gives you? Businesses pass out? That is a correct answer, just like the one Zach had this morning. You probably gave out some for county commission chairman when you ran. One or two. I never got one, so I don't wear a hat. <laughs> you can tell by my hair. <laughs> Quality co-op product. That is what Donald, they call them gimme hats with a big duck bill on them. Huh. Oh. Just in case somebody ever asked y'all that question today, now, now you know. No. Here's one you ladies ought to know in a heartbeat. In less than a year, eggs have gone from being expensive staple to the height of the bird flu, now to reaching a low. Last week, basically, how much, what was the least price for a dozen of eggs? Dollar no, nine. No. I got 55 cents a dozen. Over at Abby. 89 cents. 59, 55 cents was the official really? answer. 55 cents? Where are over my buyers? Aldi, Aldi had them about. for 89. Over, over at Addie's, and they also had the But I'll let you, you said 89? Oh, wow. I don't know what they are down at the hometown, but we have to. I'm going to skip that story for she tomorrow. Huh? She wouldn't know. She don't buy girls. I'm not a big Hard golfer, cooker. but I love. David, you play golf? <laughs> well, then you ain't going to know the answer to this one either. Uh, <laughs> the British Open was one of the greatest golf you matches awesome. ever. When Phil Nicholson shot 63 the first day, he almost set a record, 62. 62. Right. In how many major championships 
has it been since anybody shot a 62? Oh, God. They've never done it. So since they've been doing it, how many championships, major championships has it been? In just the open or? The four. How many of them has it taken and nobody's time? ever done it? Well, there's four. Yeah, probably. 150? Probably 500. I'll let you have it, Mr. Know-it-all. 437. Yeah. Only Jeff Hodges would have actually known the exact day, but that's good enough to get that right there. So there you go. That was a... Uh, all right, here's another one for you, Know-it-all. <laughs> AL.com AL. AL. did a thing on the top Alabama players from Alabama and Auburn that went to the NFL. What was the top player ever? And some of them may not have gone to NFL. What was the voted the top player ever? Who was from that? Alabama? Joe Name. You know, surprisingly, that's what I would say because he's my hero. But yeah. wrong. But I, 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 maybe there's a little boy from Foley. Um, not Stapler. Not 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 Marcel Darius is the richest, the richest contract. Marcel Darius. Yeah, I know, but there, I'm talking about richest voted about the number best. one player Glass from the state of Alabama. Are you talking about Alabama? Uh, uh, the guy from the, the state. The snake. From the state. Oh, Jackson. He didn't have Jackson. to play, they, but he did. This guy did. Was it Bo? No. Nope. Uh, Leroy. Oh, I knew he was going to say that. Leroy Jordan. His final game was 70 years ago. Big John. Oh, uh, Perry Gilmer. Don, oh, Don Hudson. Don Hudson stands alone at the top. He was number one out of a hundred. College Football Hall of Fame, 1951. Pro Football Hall of Fame, 1963. He holds records that are still intact today. Really? See how much y'all learned today? Yeah, but does he put them up on the wall like those records you put in a frame and all that? All right, here we go. <laughs> Get your own game show, Dr. Smith. <laughs> <laughs> the Rock, Dwayne Johnson. Yes. Has a Q, Danny should be here. Has a Q rating of 70%. That's double what the average actor and television personality has. What did he make last year? $50 million. A ton of money. $120 million. Sixty-four and a half only. Um, Is that all, man? Yeah. How He's much sleeping. money did San Andreas make that movie he was in? San Andreas. <laughs> that action San Andreas. Four hundred seventy-three million. million. <laughs> that action. All right, anyway, said ball we went. To, if y'all taking y'all's grandson yet to see the Secret Life of Pets? Not going this cute. weekend. It's in three D now. So. Yes. Cute. I've still got my glasses. I don't know if you feel tanning them back yeah, in we, or not. How much money has that movie done since it started two weeks oh, ago? Sixty-eight million. Sixty-eight million. Glad you ain't doing the math around here. You're wrong, know it all. <laughs> no, that's smart. Two hundred and three million. <laughs> wow. wow. They did a survey of top movie dogs. Pay attention. What was the top, according to USA Today, top movie dog of all time? Ren Tin Tin. You know, I've got Ren Tin Tin written right here, but Ren Tin Tin ain't listed on here. Lassie. 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 Lassie is at number six. Oh, come on. What? And what year did Lassie come out? 1965? 1943. Yeah. I was wrong. The number one, <laughs> movie, the number one dog is like, but Doug. No idea. What? Who? Doug. Who's Doug? Best movie dog called Doug is your dog. It's a Pixar <laughs> thing. Marley was second. Marley. Beethoven three. I was going to say Beethoven. Buddy fourth. Buddy. Uggie the, from The Artist. Toto from The Wizard of Oz. Lady and the Tramp. Beethoven. And Zorro, our dog, came in at 11. <laughs> Lady in and Tootsie came in 12. All right, two other quicks, then I'll get to some hard questions, okay? <laughs> USA Today this morning. What is the number one summer lawn game that Americans play? Cornhole. Corn Corn what? Corn <laughs> well, y'all said that. Is That's all wrong. That's all you see these days. 35% of Americans play horseshoes is the number really? one game. I don't see nobody playing horseshoes. You believe that? No. I see them play cornhole, but not horseshoes. Yeah, I wish they'd name it something else, but anyway, that's the way it is. <laughs> what percentage of people say they would rather travel with their mobile device like this, this than their loved one? This 65%. Really 45%. 85%. Give it to Blake. 81% is the right answer. Uh, is that oh my God. sad? Zach, give me some words of wisdom, then I'll get to some hard questions. Hey, if terrible. all my friends were to jump off the bridge. He's terrible, 81%. Hold it, Zach speaking. <laughs> Zach speaking. Zach speaking. If all my friends were to jump off a bridge, I wouldn't jump with them. I'd be at the bottom of the kitchen. Oh, 
They need somebody back. If my mom, I'd say would, I guess if they all jumped off a bridge, you'd do it too. No, I push most of them. <laughs> <laughs> That's you. All right. For the first time in six years, Chick Fil A has added a new breakfast item. Oh, I don't know. English, where's Matthew? English, what is it? English muffin. Um, What's the official name of it? Oh. But that's wrong. Oh. <laughs> oh Just knew Michelle had it. Oh. Egg white grill. Egg. What did it replace? Real eggs. <laughs> yeah. Spicy oh, chicken biscuit. biscuit. Oh. oh, they replaced the spicy chicken. Oh. No, I'm, I'm done, Matthew. No, that was my favorite. Not. In the great state of Alabama, what is Birmingham's latest thing to be known for? In Birmingham? Yeah, Birmingham. They're, they're embarrassed again. Not getting arrested would be a good thing. Uptown. What? Uptown. Sixth worstest city in America yeah. to live in. Oh. Woo! It's not good. What is the most expensive city in Alabama? It's got kind of a three-way tie here. Well, Mine's. It's not Hoover, Mountain Brook, or anything in the Birmingham area. <clears throat> it's not Athens. Help <laughs> not. <laughs> I don't know, but because you answered such a stupid question, I'll give it to you. Piney Chapel. Daphne, Fairhope, and Foley, Daphne. even though they're still seven and a point seven less expensive than national average. All right. Wow. Winner take all. In quest. This is a two of a three parter here. They did a survey of about two or three thousand adults. What you must stop doing at a certain age. You know this, one, don't you? Shut up. <laughs> at what should women? At what age should women stop wearing bikinis? Age forty. Listen.